So how are we going to figure out this waifu war? It's time for some motherfucking support conversations in here. You all know what the deal is, man. It is time. And as you can see, with my boy Robin, we got a couple of people to talk to here. Um, Sairi is one of them. Lukina is another one. And Kajel. Three potential cuties that Robin could all... Robin could cream pie. The sister of Lucina. This this super, super spirited chick from... I don't even know where the hell she's from. I can't remember the name of it. And then Kajel. Oh, man. He could, he could get one or two of the sisters. That's crazy. Iron Deoxys864 saying, Robin is stupid. Come at me, bro. I don't believe that, bro. I don't believe that, bro. But it is time for us to get into the meat and potatoes of the waifu wars, man. It's time to get into the support. Who's going to catch the cream pie? I don't know. But we're about to find out, man. Let's see what Robin's interactions are with Lucina on level C. Let's get into it, man. Whew. I think that's enough work for one day. Good evening, Robin. I wonder if I might have a word. It begins from Link Master. You already know, my boy. Waifu Wars. Let's go. <laughs> Hello, Lucina. What can I do for you? <laughs> Yo. Robin, please stop pimping. He has to... Do you notice that Robin has a Lenny face on 24-7? Look at his face right now. Look at Robin's fucking face. That's a Lenny face right there. Um, There's something important I want to talk to you about. And only to you. Oh, okay. We. Oh, that's it. It's over. <laughs> it's over. Should we? Should we? I can see. I, I can. Like, no homo. I can sense this nigga Robin's balls getting tight right now, yo. I can feel it, yo. <laughs> that sounds a bit ominous. Yes. Specifically, it's about the future events of my own terrible timeline. Okay, things are getting serious now. No, no cream pies. T get the cream pies out the fucking chat. It's getting serious. T-Bone says, nigga, damn, that's a shame. 12.50. Get out of here. Etika, you should use this as your background music. Yo, I'll check it out later, T-Bone. Thank you. And I'm um, taking top spot once again. I told my tale before, but I want you, more than anyone, to understand its importance. Yeah. I see. Please continue. In the future, almost no corner of our world is safe for humans. <coughs> Risen proud the land as masters of all. The people cower in terror, helpless. It sounds like a nightmare come true. I can scarce imagine it. It is a hell on earth. God damn, like I said, future trunks, Dragon Ball Z shit. She reminds me so much of that. That is why we cannot, we must not lose this war. Do you see that? You must ensure that Krom and this brave army avert catastrophe. Yeah. I will do everything in my power, Lucina, I swear. I will never stop fighting for you and Krom and all the people I of the world. Gratitude. That is what I wanted to hear. Thank you, Robin. That was definitely a more, more kind of serious conversation. The, you know, Lucina, she comes from some fucked up shit, man. We gotta acknowledge that, man. Samus says, I can create a mini black hole with my arm cannon. If you get on your knees and lick my feet right now, I'm sure I can work on resurrecting Tharja. But if I do, her ass is mine before it's yours. What kind of a deal is that? What kind of a deal is that, Samus? You can do me something better than that, girl. What the hell? Um, I do appreciate the offer, though, I guess. Um, Nord Pollock says, when you get Lissa or Robin's kid paralogs, do them straight away. They're the easiest ones. Also, go with your heart. If you go, if you, I'd love if you go with Lissa. It's your choice and don't let anyone pressure you. Thank you. I'll keep that in mind. And thank you for the five dollars as well, too, man. So many things to take into account with this whole war of the waifus, man. Anyways, Sayri, a girl I've been really curious about in the future. Let's see what she has to say in personal accord with Robin. I'm really curious about this one. Let's go. Um, Silver saying, I compete for top spot, but I ain't oil rich. Yo, man, you ain't got that AR money? That AR money? Yo, I'm, pl I'm playing around. I'm sorry. Um, I compete for top spot. Lord HR, please take it off for us. <laughs> Humiliate these men. Yo, HR, man, don't do shit, dog. Just enjoy the stream, dog. You ain't got to do shit. Yeah, no one's got to fight for fucking top spot. But okay, Robin and Sayri, here we go. I got a question for you, Sayri. Then I shall strive to answer it. She's going to strive, all right, my boy. She's going to strive. <laughs> It's about your armor. I've never seen anything like it. Where did you get it, and how fast can I take it off? This, it's a common enough sight in Chon Sin. All warriors wear a variation. The shape is unusual, but clever in its design. The plating looks tough as well. Hardened liquor? It keeps the armor light while providing excellent defense. Shadow Marth JTW with a fucking $35 donation. 
I'm a newer subscriber, but I have to say I love your videos. Here's a good old, here's a little good luck charm. Take care of yourself, man. That you can continue posting. God damn, bro. Oh, he shitted on everybody in here, yo. Yeah, top spot is gone. <laughs> he took that shit. He strong on that shit. Yo, man. Just push 2,000 niggas to watch my boy. Pick a wife who truly best. 2,000 niggas? 2,078 niggas are watching right now. Holy shit. Top spot taken by this nigga, Shadow Marth, yo. Fucking beast mode, yo. It's quite rare. Anonymous viewer saying, if you want to see the future Lucina lives in, you should get the Future Pass DLC pack. It's hella worth it. I'll try that out um, after I guess I beat the game. It's quite rare to see heavy armor where I come from. And we wield a curved single edge blade in both hands, so we do not carry shields. I see. That's a far cry from what I'm used to. Are there any other important differences? Right. Hey, a world's worth, sir. Oh shit. I know them girls are different over there. <laughs> I know them girls are different. Godzilla saying probably the last donation. Just wanted to put Robin in church as an option. I can see Robin wanting to cream pie a girl while riding that dragon in international airs. Yo, that's some kinky shit, my boy. I didn't even think of that, man. Everyone in this chat has a fetish that's just so interesting, yo. I appreciate the fucking suggestions. <laughs> You'd find most of Chon Sin culture curious. Food, dress, pussy, everything. <laughs> everything. I'd love to hear more sometime. If you don't mind, that is, my boy needs to stop. So Robin, weird. please stop. Of course, I will be honored. Talk of my homeland keeps it close to my heart. Robin, please stop pimping these chicks, man. You gotta stop, Robin. He has to stop. He can't do this, man. He can't cream pie the girl from Chun C. I don't know what the fuck is going on, man. Robin needs to stop this shit. There's too much pimping going on. There's too much pimping going on. And now, Robin is going to... We're going to see what Robin's interactions are with uh, Lucina and Cr Lucina's sister, Krom's daughter. Um, the one who I guess doesn't get as much attention, Kajel, who seems to be a real cutie pie in her own regard. I'm super curious about this one. Let's see what happens. Face me. Hey. Oh, goodness, what's wrong? You look like you sprinted Fight here. With me. Spar with me. No practice weapons. No quarter. Spar with me for true. Holy shit, baby. You trying to get lit up? You trying to get lit up? No protection? No nothing? No protection? You want him to go raw, dog? Um, kinky silver Absol. What the hell, silver man? Fetishes with Etika. Yes, that's a new segment. I didn't see this coming. Come on, then. Those who lack strength have no place in this army. Robin, she wants you to pull it out, bro. It's time to fucking perform. Kajel, she's more direct, yo. You, she's direct to you, Robin. Direct, my boy. Yo, man. Samus says, well, my offer unfair too harsh? Well, if you want Tharja back, I can figure out a way to do it. If you do a good job, look at my <laughs> I might let you watch me make thoughts. <laughs> yo, Samus, yo, you a beast. Samus, there's no time for you in the stream right now, girl. We got waifu to catch here, man. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta get out of here before you take my waifu from me, Samus. Don't fuck around with that shit. Get the hell out of here, girl. Yo, man. Was it too soon to do that direct joke? I know it was too soon. I'm so fucking sorry. I didn't mean to offend anybody, man. Iwata, rest in peace, man. We all love you to death, but I had to. Iwata understands the importance of the Robin Cream Pot. I mean, he's the CEO of Nintendo. He knows where I'm coming from. He was a young man. We were all young men at one point. We were all young men. I'm a young man. Robin's a young man. Something's got to get cream pot. I will be the one to test you. What? You think me weak? You, you don't know about this dick? I will save judgment until we have crossed the weapons. But I advise you not to take me lightly. I'm stronger than most men. Um... I refuse your challenge. Only a fool risks injury in anything more than practice. And by your tone of voice, I'm guessing this is more than simple what? training. Ha, look at the craven. Are you so afraid of losing to a woman? No. I don't think that's it, good job. I'm afraid that satisfying your idle curiosity isn't reason enough for me to fight. There's got to be some more that's in the line for me to get involved with Joe. ass. There, that's what it is. That's what it is right there, man. Robin, yo. Robin, yo. We've more than enough fighting to do as it is. Save it for our opponents. <sighs> Coward, craven, yellow belly, gutless, recurrent, faint hearted cur. God damn. For the love of God fucking damn it, fine. We'll spar. But just this once. Grieving Silver says, I'm wearing my Thank You Water shirt right now. What the fuck? I'm not okay right now. Yo, Silver, man, I'm sorry, man. I didn't mean to offend anyone, man. It's all lighthearted. You guys know I'm an idiot. This is like South Park over here. We. <laughs> <coughs> Holy shit, though. But all right, just this once. Once will be enough. Oh, I don't know about that, Kajel. You don't know what you're getting into, man. 
she wants to get with Robin, yo, and she doesn't know, man. Robin, he, he's Robin is a very soft-spoken individual. But if it gets down to combat, if it's time to time to get down, put in some action, put in some work. Robin, he'll 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 he'll, he'll shock the shit out of you. <laughs> yo. Eventually, you should play Undertale. I think you would like it, man. Yo, Nathan, yo, I, I was thinking about it, dude. A lot of people were suggesting that game. Um, now that you suggested it. I might just give it a try, but either way, we're going to be playing something after Fire Emblem, so I mean, it might be Senra and Kagura, it might be Undertale, I'll think about it, dude. Thank you for the support once again, Nathan, always cool having a guy like you in my corner, but more reasons than one, you're a cool dude, man. Once will be enough, have at you. Alright, so you know, these entry conversations, you know, they're not as, I guess, as explicit as I make them out to be, but I mean, you know, hey, they're still interesting. And uh, I like the kind of interaction that Robin has with Kajel, because obviously, if once she respects Robin, she already respects him. But at this point, after they spar, she'll see, wow, he's so viable. And he's so cute. Oh my god. <laughs> She's gonna get the fucking creeper. <laughs> but um, now we can get down to the nitty gritty. My boys, it's time for a slobbed knob. Let's go to the support. So now we have a couple more of these, and there were a couple other things that I did too. Muriel. We are in a waifu shortage right now. Somebody pointed out to me that Anna and Seiri both only go with Robin, which means that these girls are not really viable for any other dudes in our party. That means that we are at a waifu shortage because if we, if Robin doesn't marry Anna or Seiri, they're not marrying anybody, which means that none of the other characters who are guys are going to be able to get a chance to go out with those girls. So automatically right now we are down a lot of viable girls a lot of a lot of girls that can get cream pod mint berries in here too i'm glad to see you around man so it's been a little while hashtag shadow youtube bro everyone's hype about that i'm just not you know like you guys already know the details um when it's something that i'm excited about i post a video about it shadow mewtwo doesn't really give me a boner so um i didn't post but that doesn't mean that you know i'm not excited for pokemon the shadow mewtwo doesn't really give me an erection um there's not a lot of Nintendo news out right now that's exciting, really. It's just a lot of speculation. But I am looking forward to when that new Nintendo Direct comes out. And of course, when that happens, you know I'm going to be on top of it. But right now, Nintendo news is kind of slowing down a bit. And me and my crazy sleep schedule as well makes it even more kind of hard to keep up with videos. Well, not hard in a sense, but I mean, I have some ideas, though. Trust me. Um, King Outrage is in here, too. Master Seal Church to Kellum Rider. Yo, she's about to catch a seal. Kellum's about to break a seal. I can tell you that much. Oh man, but okay, so we have some more conversations here. We have one with Muriel and Dickin Rickin. Rickin needs something to put his dick in, my boy. The word no. Oh shit, I remember you. Good luck with Fire Emblem tonight. I will actually be waiting for my Fire Emblem Awakening fanfiction tonight. Oh, you'll be writing it tonight while you watch. Hopefully, we'll grant some extra luck somehow. Yo, that I can see happening, yo. Like, if you're writing erotic Fire Emblem fantasies, then watching my stream while doing so will definitely send some of that positive energy over to me. So I appreciate it. Thank you so much. We are 800 viewers strong right now. That's a lot of niggas. All you niggas is looking for cream pies to be done tonight. Y'all some fucking perverts, man. 800 of y'all niggas. Y'all all fucking perverts. What are y'all doing, man? Y'all want to see some cream pie action live? Let's see some cream pie action. Um, emotional Silver Absol saying, Iwata isn't here. There can't be any Nintendo Directs. Damn, man. That, that logic... That logic, Iwata wouldn't want that. You know that. You have to get over your emotions, man. Iwata would want the Direct to live on. He would want fans to be even more excited for the future Directs than the ones that happened in the past, man. You know that's how. That's what he would want. Definitely. But okay. Okay. So now we also have No Way, or Naoi. I'm just going to call her Naoi. And um, she also has a conversation with Donnie. So let's see. Naoi's conversation is on B level. Who knows what this might look like? Fingerless James with a dollar saying, Can you feel it, Edgar? Fire Emblem Fates on Nintendo Direct on the horizon. Yo, I already know what the deal is, man. Even though we know pretty much everything about Fates now, still, there may be some changes made for the localization of it in Europe and America, so there's a lot to be hyped for. Let's get into what Donnie... All right, now. He's gonna, he gonna do that with his dick. All right, now. Yeah. <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, X-Clone 4000. 4, 4200 saying... I'm a big fan of yours. Make my hellish day worth it and slob the knob. Morgan is best waifu, though. Morgan? Who the hell is Morgan? Do we have a Morgan here? We don't have a Morgan here. Maybe it's somebody that we're going to meet later on. Either way, let's not waste any more time. Let's see what Donnie and Naoi got to say yes. on B-Rank. Hey, Donnie. I remembered where I was born. Where at? Listen. It's all the way left from here. Huh? 
You mean west? No, left. Across the ocean and way to the left. I sure I ain't follow. I ain't sure I follow. You don't know any landmarks or nothing? And not really. I was kidnapped right after I was born. That's terrible. It's my dream to go back to my homeland someday. I mean, maybe I've got friends and family there. Well, if I find it first, I reckon I'll be sure to start coming. Wait to come running and tell you. Really? You promise? Oh, and if I find it, I'll come tell you too. Now that there's a square deal right there. Horny Iron Deoxys. What the hell? Um, let me see some Donnie Cream Pie Dragon action. Yeah, it looks like you're about to. You came right in time. And you're about to come right on time, my man. <laughs> oh, yo. Yo. Okay. Yeah, I'm really hungry. I sure do have trouble keeping up with you sometimes, Nowie. But if your tummy's rumbling, I set me a cup. I set me a trap a couple days ago. Want to see if we caught anything? If we got us a rabbit, I'll fix you a Donnie special. Oh, Lord. Hey, you're the bestest, Donnie. Aw. You know, that, that was a real sweet conversation right there. You know, those two are definitely bonding on more of a real friendship kind of level. I like it. I like it. Don, Donnie, he's a sweetheart overall. You know, I know I make a ton of jokes about these characters. But Donnie, he's a real sweet guy deep down. You know, he, he, he a lot of positive attributes about him. I, I really can't be mad at that. I can't even joke about that, man. Donnie's a cool dude. Um, that's why he's one of my favorite characters in this game. Yeah! <laughs> that's my nigga Don. <laughs> oh my lord, have mercy. My pothead nigga Don. But okay, so we also have a conversation with Henry. Oh lord. Shadow Marv is in here, yo! Yo, what's up my man, Etika? Damn, glad to see the stream again. What you got for us today? By the way, Church and Kellum are a really great pair. I do not regret... I do not regret doing so myself. Church's child will have godlike defense. It seems like Church and Don and, and um, Kelm are kind of going to be a good endgame couple right there, man. I'm excited for it. That might just be the one for me. But um, we'll see what's going on with Henry and these two chicks right here. Lissa and Maribel with Henry. I don't even want to think about what could possibly happen with that. Give her the fucking Donnie special. This nigga Donnie. All right, Donnie. All right, Donnie. <laughs> Let's go, Donnie. My voice said, yo, man, thank you once again, though. Um, <coughs> once again, to Shadow Mark, though. Always, always dropping those crazy amounts, man, and showing them insane support. Wordness says, the fan fiction is not erotic. What are you doing? You're in a Fire Emblem stream, writing a Fire Emblem fan fiction, and you're not making it sexual? I'm disappointed in you. What's going on? <laughs> the story is actually a future disowned is a plot focused while the other love across time is all shameless robin and lucina shipping fluff oh okay so it's so it is somewhat sensual not just not erotic i suppose that's okay nothing not everything's got to be sexual not everything's got to be perverted like my fucking brain is i'm fucked up <laughs> i'm fucked up the donnie special you know what it is hey but now he don't look like she's legal so i don't know how many jokes i can make my boy i don't know how many jokes i can make i'm just gonna laugh and nod because I ain't trying to go to jail, man. You can say she's a thousand. Okay, I guess so. But god damn it, yo. I can't say nothing about that. You niggas going to have me fucked up, man. FBI going to be breaking down my door. I'm going to be like, I got I got swatted? They're like, no, you're, this is the van. You're going to jail, my boy. We heard what you said about that little girl. I was like, oh, okay. Lissa and Henry, let's go. So, did you, do, did you ever get... Did you get over your insomnia, Lissa? Yep, as soon as I close my eyes, I'm out like a candle. That pill, Cosby? <laughs> I don't know what changed. <coughs> but I'm super glad it did. Well, just a little touch of Henry's super sleepy time, Matt. Oh, what the... Oh, come on. I was joking with that pill, Cosby thing. I was joking with that shit. I didn't actually think this nigga drugged her. This nigga drugged her. Huh? That was you? Oh, oh... This nigga's on some shit. This is fucked up, Henry. She said, really? That was... She's, the way, I can imagine her saying it in the situation, too. Like, really? That was you? Oh, my God. Those pills, man. This nigga's fucked up. I mean, I always knew Henry was a little weird, but he's on a whole nother level with this shit. This is some twisted shit right here. <laughs> always happy to lend a helping curse. I suppose it would be a roofie, huh? That can't be healthy long term. No, let's say it's not healthy long term. It's not healthy long term, girl. Look at her face. What is this nigga giving this little girl? She's a little girl, my boy. She's barely legal. And what do you have to do to set it up? 
some kind of weird ceremony? Nah, I just drop it in the glass. <laughs> That's it. It's not so much trouble. Yeah, I know. I know it ain't trouble, man. He, he buy one. That's it. <laughs> That's the hardest part is probably finding fresh sacrifices every time. What? Oh, oh, oh. T-Bone says, all right, I'm broke. You got it, Shadow. My bones are not hard enough. See you in the next stream. Yo, T-Bone, don't worry about it, man. I see you in the stream, T-Bone. I just wish the colors stayed the same for the people's names because they're always changing, so it makes it tough to kind of apply a color to someone's name specifically. Yo, man. This nigga, he, he spiked her fucking drink. Yup, I usually just use birds or something. Stop, you can't go robbing poor little birdies of their lives for something like this. I'd rather go sleepless and live with that sort of guilt. First, you don't want any allies or enemies to die, and now birds are off the table. Birdies, you're a strange one, Lissa. I'm the strange one. You're one to talk. Look, I'll find a solution on my own. No cute creature's deaths required. So no more curses. Got it? Yes, no sir. more pills either. Get that shit out of the camp. This is a horrible matchup. How are these two ever going to get along? That one, that, that, <laughs> no, no. Henry is kind of twisted, my boy. He's kind of funny for it, though, but I mean, I don't condone drugging little girls. I am so weary of this godforsaken war. Every time we turn around, Risen are tearing some poor village apart. Uh, I feel this will get all darker before we finally spy the dawn. <laughs> and yet, look at this flower still finding a way to bloom amongst the devastation. It brings a tear to my eye to see such a fragile thing struggle to the light. What a good flower you are. Stay strong now, little one. Hey, hey there, Mabel. You alright? <gasps> Henry, how long have you been standing there? Mm -hmm. I don't know, since before you launched into that soliloquy? Oh, that's a new word. I've never seen that word before. Sulaquity? Wretched beast. Eavesdropping is a shameful habit, sir. And on a lady, no less. Were you birthed in a barn? <laughs> <laughs> this girl doesn't give a damn. Aw, oh, but it's fun listening to you mumble. You say all kinds of crazy stuff. I really like that last bit when you started chatting with the flower. Well, I was not chatting with the flower. I was remarking, well, that's to say, well, what's the use? You caught me in the act, and that's that. Go on then. Point and laugh. Take this chance to mock your social betters. Um, Masahiro Sakurai. Oh, Daddy Sakurai, thank you. You wanted Mewtwo? I bought him back. You wanted Lucas? I bought that fucker back too. Now you want Shovel Knight. Who the fuck is Shovel Knight? That's it, you motherfuckers. Smash Brothers. Ballot delayed until 2018. Damn. You heard it here first, guys. Etika World Network exclusive. Masahiro Sakurai just confirmed that the Smash Ballot will be pushed back to 2018. Ain't that some shit? The Wordna with another dollar talking about her fan fiction. I shouldn't assume that you're a girl just because you're making fan fiction. You could be a dude too. Dudes, dudes do it too. You should get Henry Alyssa to A support still. The A support suddenly becomes surprisingly cute. Also, oh god, I'm running out of money. Yo, that's why you need to keep that shit in your pocket and maybe buy some more pens and shit instead of giving it to my black ass so I can use it on more strippers. I'm playing around, please. I, I, I'm just joking around, okay? I'm fucking with you. I'm not serious when I say that. No. Mock you? Why? I do the same thing all the time. Hmm, what's that flower? Oh, okay, I'll tell her. What, what in the world Good are you doing? Times. Talking to the flower. She says she's grateful that you spoke to her. Also, she says she'll stay as strong as long as you do, too. Um, I appreciate the gesture, sir, but you don't have to feign madness for my sake. King Outrage saying Maribel super hot fire with a dollar. Yo, Aww. she was, she was spin. I'm not feigning anything. I'm just really in touch with the natural world. I can talk to any living thing you want. Trees, flowers, and maggots included. Oh, maggots. That is a remarkable talent, if a shade disturbing. Yes, Henry is a shade disturbing. His conversation with the girls, not, they, none of them look like they would go well. Maybe him and Tharja would get along kind of nicely, but uh, that isn't something we'll be able to see. Now is it? Damn, man. If I had known that there was this much interaction and this much of a bond made with the characters, maybe I wouldn't have done an Iron Man run, but too late for that. So now we have another conversation here with Rickon looking for something to put his dick in. My boy, my boy is about to talk to Muriel. Let's see what's going on here. Hold a moment. Muriel, you better not do anything crazy to that boy. That's a young man right there. You better not do nothing wild, girl. I, I, I don't know, man. You cougars, girl. I don't know, man. <laughs> She's going to teach him some things, my boy. She's going to put that hat down, my boy. <laughs> She's going to... Yo, my boy, <laughs> she's gonna put that hat now. I, I have some things I need to teach you. <laughs> just, just go to work. <laughs> go to work on him. Yo, man, he'll he, he have the same face on while he's getting his knob slapped. <laughs> Anyways, Henry has like 
that slightest tinge of friendliness. It's pretty badass. He even gave you money when you left him behind at the coast that one time. Really? It's been so long, man. I can barely remember. Um, somebody in the chat can apparently code hanger abortions. Uh, that. Wow. Why does somebody of your expertise have a place in my chat? I don't. I don't know. Um, Herm says esports. I don't know what you're talking about. Administer the spell to the charcoal, if you please. Got it. Whoa. And success. How nice. Wait, hold on. Why did it glow like that? And why was it that color? This is another byproduct of the spell's magical energy. So I don't suppose this has any combat applications yes. either. Absolutely none. Listen. And since the thunderbolt already glows, why bother with no. the coal at all? Practical use is not my concern. I conduct experiments to uncover natural truths. Mm. Well, gee, I never really stopped to think about anything like that. So what's the next experiment? Anything I can help with? Oh. Right. I welcome your assistance, but as I said, it is likely to be a dubious use at best. <laughs> no, that doesn't matter. Let me help. This is real cutting-edge stuff. I mean, maybe you'll find some amazing use for it after all. Plus, we're tossing lightning bolts around, and that's fun. No, it's good to see some. It's good to see one so young enjoying science. Let us proceed. Yes, ma'am. Man, this is some. This is some Onechan type shit, man. Like this nigga, how is he gonna get his dick in that? I mean, Ricky, I know you got something to put your dick in, but you gonna put it in that? I don't know, my boy. It's, it's looking kind of, looking kind of uh, difficult to get into right there. Then we have a lot of their conversation with Sully and Kajel. Um, mother and daughter here, man. I thought that was Kellen for a second, but, um, Linkmaster says, I sure came in late. How are you doing? Yo, thanks a lot for the concern about my well-being, dude. Um, I'm doing okay, man. I'm trying to get used to this crazy sleep schedule, so we're probably going to be streaming for maybe like an hour more, or at least until we finish a chapter. So, we'll see. But I was hoping that maybe we could stream something else afterwards. We'll figure this all out as we go along. But, um, let's see what Sully and Kajel are saying. Press 1 for Etika's dick from Masahiro Sakurai. After you just pushed back the ballot to 2018 you want people to press one for you they can they, you can oblige in the chat if you want to but this nigga i don't know i still i still love you though you're still my daddy i mean hey that means the ballot will come out around the time of indivisible if it makes its campaign goal so you know great news for everyone let's go to kajel and sully mother and daughter relationship this is going to be touching i can already tell all right that's it for today's training yes ma'am thank you ma'am so am i any better on horseback maybe just a little what do you think not really? Maybe I really don't have talent for it. Talent is an excuse. You lack patience, not talent. Well, you're right. I'm sorry. I just, I just got frustrated. Still, there is something strange here. How your own daughter could be such a poor writer? Nah, not that. The fact that the future me told you anything different than what I just told you myself. That it's a matter of practice, not talent? Yeah, I hate that word. Talents. Always have. So why would I ever say you lacked it? Well, to be fair, you never used the word talent. I believe your exact words were, you're not suited for writing. What the hell? Yo, so Sully in the future is a bit more pessimistic. Mellow Scar says, my nigga Etika, who you most excited for from the Smash ballot? Rayman in that bitch. So at this point now, regardless of who gets in, I'll be excited just for the fact that there's a new character that's made by us or that's voted in by us. That enough is all I'm excited about. You know I mean? If it was the Shovel Knight, Shantae, um, I really don't care. I'm just happy that we're getting a new character in the game. It's always it's always fun in my opinion. Even if it is a blue knight with a fucking shovel. I don't give a damn. If he comes in, it's new. It's exciting. Whatever. Evie Fry. Oh shit, I've been playing with your ass lately. And not in that way. I wish. <laughs> okay. Make sure you don't tell nobody that I think Robin's dick is a piece of Eden. Hey, man. Hey, that's a precursor object right there, yo. That's an object from the gods right there. Yo, I'm telling you, man. I'm telling you, Evie already knows what's up. I believe your exact words were, you're not suited for writing, but it's basically the same thing. Well, I'm sure I wouldn't say it without some reason. Uh oh, does that mean you're going to stop teaching me again? You can do this. Well, I'm no damn quitter. We'll finish what we started or die trying. Thank you. Whew, thanks. She must really suck. Still, there's something funny about all this. She must really suck at writing then, if the future Sully just straight up said, yeah, you're not, you're not a writer. Damn, so Kajel can't get on top at all? That sucks, man. She didn't see such a cutie, too. <laughs> That's fucked up of me to say. But I mean, hey, that kind of sucks. But either way, man, we are finally done with all the support, so let's save the game. Those will definitely help us out in combat, too, since a lot of these characters are usually on the field at the same time. My friends, it is time to move forward with progress in the story. 
another chapter. We're doing this real late night, but it's got to go down. And now's a bit, now's as good of a time as any, I guess. What's up, Etika? I can finally watch your stream from Comedy. Thank you. Um, by the way, did you get the DLC yet? One more thing. Try getting a Robin Virian conversation going. It's a really interesting one. Really? Okay. I'll try it out, man. I'll pair those two up together. Maybe in this in this level. But um, yo, we are re. Smiled Crane saying, hey, Etika, Virgin Channel here. Any tips? By the way, the characters sound like they are moaning, fam. Yeah, a little bit when they talk, right? Um, I can't really give you any tips right now since I'm kind of in the middle of a really important thing I got to focus on. But um, I'm, I'm working on a video that will probably be out within the next three weeks talking about what you can do as a smaller channel to get yourself out there. Although I'm still a small channel myself when you compare, like, to the overall scope of things, so I still have a lot that I'm learning on this journey too. So you're not getting information from a pro. You'd probably be better off asking a bigger person, someone who has millions of subs, because they're probably going to be more experienced and know how to handle a large audience a lot better than me. Because I'm still, like I said, I'm still learning this shit. But um, Etika, don't do that paralog. It's hard as shit. I already learned, man. I saw when we entered it before, and I left that bitch because that thing looked like it was going to break our balls in half. We need to train a little bit more before we get into something like that. So. Let's do this. We're going to save the game one more time. And we're going to start this new chapter, man. Let's see what this holds in store for us. Inex inexorable death? Oh, shit. 